On some types of Russian tanks, it appears on the front there is a pair of red lights on. The pair of glowing red lights is often a symbol of the Russian tank. So, what does it do? The device that appears to emit red light on the tank is an electro-optical active protection system which is named Stora 1 or which literally means curtain. Stora is an active protection system with soft skills type, which prevents threats in the form of anti-tank. The Stora 1 armored fighting vehicle defense system was developed by Zenit Research and Production. This system is able to increase the vehicle's resistance on the battlefield against attacks from anti-tank weapons. The two red lights on the Russian tank are a component of the Stora system, known as infrared jammers or also known as desilers. This lamp emits infrared rays with a certain frequency pulse which is the same as the frequency used by the enemy. The sensor will record the frequency used by the enemy and then imitated by the transmitting device. The device will then emit the infrared beam in a distorted direction. With this, the anti-tank missile control system will be confused so, the attack route fails to hit the tank. Infrared rays cannot actually be seen by the eye directly. The red light is usually turned on during the parade to give a cool impression. However, in actual operation, these infrared rays are invisible to the eye. The conclusion is that the tool only serves to interfere with anti-tank guided missiles. And it might also have an additional function, which is to make the tank look more sinister, if you're lucky you might be able to lower your opponent's mentality. The Stora system is installed in several Russian main battle tanks, such as the Ukrainian T-90, T-80, and T-84 tanks. So that's what the two red lights on a Russian tank do.